What's up? What's up? What's up? Yeah. Check it out. I got this right here. Let me show you what it do. I'm going to bust it open with my big blade. Hold on. Hold on. I need two hands. Dig that. We're inside, folks. We're in. All right. This is from my people at Race Day Quads. Dig that, man. Dig that. Got a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. Not just quads. You can get you some stuff for your RC cars and shit, too. Check it out. Race Day Quads, bro. All right. Main event. GNSS Performance Analyzer. All right. We got it. We got one. Finally got one. I wasn't going to get one, but I said, well, let me see what these cars are doing. My nitros. So, we got one. Let's bust it open. Just like that. Just like that. We're in. We're in, people. There it is. There it is. There it is. All right. This is a run cam cube. I don't know if y'all know what that is. A little action camera by run cam. <laughs> if anybody know what these are, they'll know that's not that bad. It's, it's, it's a little chunky. It's a little chunky, like a little chunky. Another candy bar with a single one. It's like a little chunky. All right. Get that. That's all you're getting for your money. That's all you're getting, people. And I got a strap. Nice strap, but it starts shredding in the strings and stuff. It's cool for your RC car, but for your quad, I wouldn't want to keep it close to the props. But there it is. Let's see what we're going to learn and do. And I'm going to show you how it works. Yes. So we're charging it up before we use it. And then the next step would be to install the app. Let's see how we're going to go about that. Okay, people. I got the apps on. I have to download two apps. The GNNS app and then the RC Car app. Here. So if I hit that, that's what comes up. And I touch that, I get this screen. Okay, I go back. And if I hit that, and I hit the GNNS, GNSS, let's see it's loading. And some satellites will show up there, my battery, and my Wi-Fi. But I don't see anything. So. I am charging it up, and I see all the lights are on. So that means the Wi-Fi and all that stuff is... I guess on there. I guess it takes a minute for it to connect here. I'm not sure. We'll see. So now we got the battery strength percent. I got seven satellites and I'm inside the house and my Wi Fi is lit up. So there you go. Let's see if I move the sensor. Yeah, so when I move it, you can see the numbers is changing. But I want it to get to a speed and stay at that speed. And it's not doing that, so we're going to have to find a way to configure that. Let's take a look into it and see what we can do. Yeah, okay, it's going to be about three hours for this right here to become fully charged. So we'll see you on the street.
That's right. Stay tuned. Here we out here, YouTube. We out here. I don't know what the heck I'm doing, but we got the car. We got the GNSS analyzer. We got that thing taped in there. We're not gonna be doing too much, so it should stay stay put. I have it the app up. Okay, the app is up. We are going to track, I guess. Bam. And then start. Alright. Yeah, she's doing something. So I hope it's recording. So... Let's see if we can get it to record. How can I set this up? This thing is slippery as all begotten. Okay, let's do this. Here, we're going to stop. Now read 40 miles an hour on that baby. Yeah, 40 miles per hour on the thing there, y'all. So we got some tuning to do on it. I don't think it's going to get much faster. Since it is a pull start stock RTR engine. But the rest of we can get it to 52, I'll be all right with that. Alright, you two. What you working with? Put it on the ground.